And, uh, I got flu though. Straight what, immediately? Away. Yeah. <laughs> what, what do you think the main differences are being over here for a tour and, and the fact that you've been in the States for so long? Um, it's hard to tell. Probably the places we're playing are smaller here. Yeah? I think that's the main difference. Mm. How do you like living in America? Love it. It's great. Why? I like the vibe of New York and I wanted to change and when I moved there I got it. You know? And it's still new. It's still kind of exciting. I haven't got bored with that yet. What do you think the main, the main, um, the main attraction is, though, to move to America? Why did you decide to go? Um, I'm not exactly sure. I'd always liked the music that came from there. You know, bands like uh, The Suicide and Velvet Underground were all like that. That was what they were all about. And I went there and loved it. Do you think that, that Americans are particularly attracted to the, the Furs because of their sort of Englishness? Do you think that makes a difference? <sighs> No, I think they like uh, rock music more, and we're more of a rock band than a pop band, and I think they like rock music. Do they think they're really weird? <laughs> no, I don't think so. <laughs> now, the, the Furs have got quite a reputation for being um, uh, quite underexposed, considering that you've had, you know, mammoth hits. Yeah, well, you're very exposed <laughs> at the moment, but quite underexposed and quite mysterious. Is that deliberate? Well, we like to keep it a bit like that, you know. We don't like doing all the stuff that goes along with being in a band. We don't like going to all the right parties and that kind of thing. It's like boring. <laughs> so, um, what do you do at night? At night? Yeah. <laughs> what night? Well, <laughs> Saturday. <laughs> Watch TV. Do you? Yeah, most now, nights. It says here that you used to not be so healthy. You look deeply unhealthy right now, actually. <laughs> oh, thanks a lot. <laughs> um, um, what sort of things happened to you? I don't know, really. I, I just... I gave up drinking. I got fed up with going out drinking and waking up feeling ill. So I gave it up. That's about the only difference. Was that? Yeah. I don't go jogging madly around the place every morning or anything like that. <laughs> Health not. <laughs> no, no. Um, do you think that um, when you're on the road all the time, though, in America, there's a temptation to just let, you, let yourself go? There isn't a lot of time to take care of yourself. You don't get to eat very well. Yeah. But, uh, and, it's, and it's exhausting. But, um, you know, we try. Do you work out? <laughs> no. no. Now, the, the three, three of the original members of the band left. What have they been doing? I've got no idea. I know Roger used to play guitars in L.A. with a band called Castle Bravo. I don't know what happened to Duncan or Vince. I saw Vince lately, but I didn't get to ask him what he was doing. Now, what kind of thing are you going to... Stop trying to look at my questions. You know, I'm right at the bottom here. What kind of um, thing do, uh, can we expect tonight? What it's it's a kind of harder sound than, we, than the last album, Mirror Moves. We've got back to more guitar edge. Uh, the last one was a bit smooth for us, I think. And what kind of thing are you going to be doing in the next few weeks? Touring. Hard. <laughs> do you dread it or do you still like it? Um, a bit of both, really. I mean, I, we love playing in front of the crowd, but all the rest of the stuff that goes with it, hotels, you know, the, all the cliches about it. I don't know. I'm not so keen on that. Do you ever so get tempted to throw trailer. your telly out the window? No. No? No. no it's too what are you wearing those clothes for then? <laughs> what are these telly You're wearing throwing telly throwing clothes. Oh, am I? Right, we're now going to go back to something very weird and bizarre the singing twins. It's the proclaimers again.